Rolling through turns three and four, coming to green. You know what time it is, folks. It's time to rock, roll, and rumble here at Irwindale. Green flag up. We are racing in Southern California. Jake Drew on the break. He's going to roll the top side of the racetrack. Look at P.J. Pedrincelli. All kinds of sideways there on a turn four. He's going to slot back into that second position. Cole Moore with a great start. He's going to slide into third. And they're all bunched up behind him as we come down to complete lap number one. Cole Moore trying to use the bottom side of the racetrack to his advantage. P.J. Pedrincelli keeping it wound up on the top side. But give the advantage to Cole Moore down the backstretch. But now here comes P.J. down to the bottom side of the racetrack. A little slip and slide, dip and dive here early in the going. Three wide now here at start finish. Here comes Trevor Huddleston into the mix. Wow, some really intense racing in the early going here at Irwindale. Let's see if he can make that bottom side work. Ooh, P.J. had a big run going down the backstretch. Off the top side of turn two, he's going to drive it in deep down into turns three and four. Ooh, talk about slip and slide, dip and dive. These drivers switching lanes, crossing each other over. Tanner to the bottom side of the racetrack now. And again, watch PJ with that run on the top side. Jake gave him a little room that time. Chuck Welch bringing the pace car down into the infield. Trevor Huddleston down to the inside. Cole Moore, Tanner Reif back in row two. Field slowly working its way through turns three and four. P.J. Pedrincelli, Todd Souza back in row three. Coming back to green as we're racing to lap 75, the halfway point here in about 10 laps. Green flag back out. Trevor Huddleston putting some pressure on Jake Drew through turns one and two and down the back stretch. There's Cole Moore to the bottom side of the racetrack. He's going to try to take over that second position. Tanner Reif right there. Ooh, almost some contact there off of turn four. Close quarters racing. Ooh, a little fender rubbing right there. Through turns three and four. Green flag back up. They're stacking them up behind. Let's see what happens down here in turns one and two. Once again. Jake Drew puts the power down, down the back stretch. Trevor Huddleston going to slot back into that second position. Cole Moore, Tanner Reif racing for position as they swing across the start and finish line. Looking lap 73, two to go to the midway point. Here it over there. Looks like Jake Drew going to hold on to that top spot. The battle now on for third. Cole Moore to the bottom side of the racetrack. He's going to slide up right there in front. And now caution again. P.J. Pedrincelli turns sideways. Oh, boy. P.J. had such a good night going. Started on the front row. Has been running up near the front of the field all night long. And he is going to go a lap down. Coming down to complete lap 78. So we will have 72 yet to go here in Irwindale. This way off of turn four. Joe Contreras with the green flag. We're back racing in the Napa Auto Parts 150. Now let's see Trevor Huddleston working the bottom side of the racetrack. The first real serious challenge for the lead we've had all night long. Let's see if they can make it stick. Cole Moore trying to make it three wide off of turn four. He can't make it stick. Jake Drew going to hold on to the top spot. Happens here on this restart. Green flag back out. We're racing down into turn one. Trevor Huddleston trying to make that bottom side work. Oh, it's so tempting, folks. You just think. All you got to do is put that power down, and you can take that lead, and that's what Cole Moore is going to try to do with that second position right now with that top side. That's the place to be here this evening. Cole Moore, again, he's, he wants to go to that bottom so bad. He wants it to work so bad. He's able to get the nose of that car out in front just enough to make him think it's going to work, but Trevor Huddleston, again, putting that power down off the top of turn two and off the top of turn four. Huddleston going to hold on to that second position. Laps quickly ticking away here. Ooh, Nick Janitis. Ooh, big time problems there in turns three and four. Caution flag out. Looks like Christian Rose in the 42, Takuma Koga in the seven, 
and Nick Janitis in the 77 car, all getting wadded up over there in turn three and four. And we saw Nick jump on the brakes, those locked up the front tires. He had nowhere to go and just stacked it in there. There's a lot of damage to the back of the 42. The seven of Takuma Koga already damaged. And you can see more damage on that number seven car. And Nick Janitis in the 77 car with some damage as well. Can Cole Moore steal the win here in the Napa Auto Parts 150? We are about to find out. Joe Contreras look at him over from the flag stand as they slowly work their way off a of turn four. Green flag back up. Let's see what happens down here in turn one. <laughs> 